Hello, my name is Mariette and I am a messenger of covenant. And in this world, during this period of time, it's very difficult for everyone in this world, especially during the Corona COVID-19 pandemic. I will explain to you of the creation of human soul and human body and the relationship between each and all of us with our almighty eternal creator. I am gifted. That's the reason that I able to understand everything I'm going to explain to you today. I will go into different area that I am not the religious person and I don't belong to any religion. I come from God. And I be as an interpreter of the Almighty Creator, love, He authority over all creation that He created, and He also always as the owner of all He creation. Let me speak this again. The Almighty Creator, He is always as the sole owner of all he creation product. The government officer, they are not have the power over the almighty creator. They are choose by the people as the public servant to help people to do things it's required to be under the law of the Almighty Creator. It means all countries are the same. There's only one, the Almighty Creator. Doesn't matter what country you born into. Doesn't matter what color of skin that you in your skin. Doesn't matter you rich, you poor, you powerful, you weak, you healthy, or you handicapped. You are under the Almighty Creator. There's only one. And your soul always that have a collection with Him. All those I still based on Scripture. Because the scripture was written by different people that the almighty creator power, I mean that the only almighty supernatural power that worked through them, revealed to them from different, two different people and they combined it in the Holy Bible. I'm talking about real Holy Bible. On the Holy Bible, there's a lot of symbolism sim, sim, and a lot of hidden meaning. But you have to understand that the Bible is the creation law summary. Remember I say summary, a lot of symbolic. You have to live your life in holiness so you can able to understand the real meaning of the scripture. Don't believe all spiritual minister or pastor if they don't live their life of serving people without thinking about them. I mean that live the life of holiness. If they don't do that, the evil get in their thought and their word and their action, they will give you wrong. It's the same thing to all people. So in order for you to understand the real meaning of the scripture, which is the meaning of the creation law, you have to live your life. 
do everything right and reject everything wrong. But there's no one perfect in this world. You still make me sick without you knowing that. If you make me sick without you knowing that and the results not harm other people too much. Of course, we'll harm you and other people, but not too much. I still consider it's at the holiness life. So today, I will based on Genesis 1, chapter 1, 26 and 27. It's talking about creation of human soul, male and female, in the image of God. God say, we us out. And you might think, why God is more than one person? There is uh, the existing of the Holy Trinity. The Holy Trinity is mean, the master of the universe. His only almighty supernatural power. He did not have human soul and he will never have human soul. The only power. And the first and the second in the Holy Trinity, one is male and another one is female. These two male and female have fully divine and fully human. That's why God say himself, we are us. Me talking about the soul, the fully God and fully human soul of the true individual. These two individuals are the first generation of human soul and the rest of the human soul that created by these two male and female, fully divine and fully human. The rest are the second generation of human soul. Okay, now the first generation soul, two soul, are fully God and fully human. They are the member of the kingdom of heaven royal. Royal. Do you hear what I said? It's kingdom of heaven royal. Not the ugly royal like the queen of England or the king of England. No, 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 not that. This royal too, male and female, is called the Messiah, is it the man? And the messenger of covenant is the woman. This woman revealed in Malachi chapter three, the messenger of covenant. She is the woman with her child. Her child is a symbolic of the ongoing creation of the earth and all living creature on earth, including human race, all sorts of skin, black, white, yellow, brown. Now, this woman on chapter 12 is the messenger of covenant and the Messiah the Messiah is the second of the Holy Trinity and the messenger of covenant is the third person of the Holy Trinity of course everybody know Jesus as a full man came in as fully God and fully man. He had already left the war. He brought nothing with him as a poor, most of the poor. He has a no relationship with any woman, single man. He left this war 
painfully. But before he left the world, raised his last breath on the Holy Cross, the messenger, the female, saw with him from the time that she was, her soul was created. She away with her older brother and she witnessed her brother went through painfully and murder on the cross. He transferred the entire inheritance of the world, human race, and everything of the living creature in this world to his younger sibling, the woman with her child, revealed on the book of Revelation that she will come and she will battle in spiritual realm, not, not, not early, not, not on earth, not, not bloodshed and all that. No, 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 she doesn't do that. Because she, as the fully divine, her power of governing that she received from her other brother, the Messiah, spoke through Jesus at a fully man voice. Woman, Behold your child. And he turned to the whole universe. He said, Son, behold your mother. That's done. He transferred in time the Almighty Eternal Creator estate. It means all the creation product over to her younger sibling, a sister who is a messenger of covenant for her to own it, own it, inherit and own it. Remember, she owned everything and she's governing. It means all the world government official leader are under her power. She doesn't governing like the earthly government governing, but she governing in a high level power by her divinity. Her mission called the kingdom of heaven were government divine world government not the ugly now i got that very clear so all the country government leader back up back up don't do like you normally done before you overpower the Almighty, you choose your farewell against the Almighty Creator. That's what happened. You saw the flow of Bala, and now is coronavirus COVID-19. Because those leaders in the government lead people to the destruction, go, go, go with the devil. That's why God sent the virus through the deadly animal to discipline human rights. Government never can win the virus. Because a virus is a power. Doctor, nurses, scientists only help for release. Vaccine never win the virus. It's only transformed from one symptom to another symptom. 
but the virus, when it contracted anyone, that power, deadly power still in your body. It will move from one illness to another illness until you come back to the Almighty. From your heart, your soul, your mind, your word, and your action to obey all the creation law. If you don't do that, I'm talking about the human soul incarnation. The human life is the soul. Without soul, there is no human life. Again, without soul, there is no human life. Human life beginning at the time of conception. The time of conception, which is the time that the soul land inside the woman womb. When the guy and the woman have intercourse and the soul grab the man's sperm and the woman ate. And from there, forming the physical body. Again, without soul, there is a no human life. It means human life from the time of conception. Now, I continue with, after the soul incarnate into the woman womb, it's starting eating whatever the woman eat. Then the soul, not the soul, but the soul spirit, the power of the soul, forming the physical body. I believe it with the heart and the brain and whatever else later. Doctor can tell you this more than I do because it's not my job to go into that detail. Therefore, it depends on where the man and where the woman Heritage, ancestor in Vietnam, where I come from. Mother, the parent of the woman, the girl, always very careful. Anyone want to marry their daughter, they're looking back the parent of the guy, the grandparent of the guy. And the same thing to the guy. The parent looked to the girl, her parent, her grandparent, and back. And see how they like. Do they live as the good people? Or they done evil thing? Because if they done evil, their grandkid will inherit it. Illness, all sorts of illness, born deformed. It's come through that man's prefer and the woman ate. That's how the inheritance, disease, and all that's come from. So I'm telling you, guy and girl, be very careful when you marry, or when you decide to have sex. With anyone looking to background of the guy. The man looking to the background of the girl. Okay? Because of the background, is the one gonna give you blessing. 
Or the one going to let your kid born deformed. Get let give your kid all sorts of illness. The doctor can tell you exactly what is inheriting of the illness. I can tell you, but I don't have time in this video. Now, when the babies in the womb completely form everything, leg, arm, heart, head, and the, the baby born in the womb. It's called the birth of a child. You remember, Jesus came in. The divine, his divine is the Messiah. He born in stable. And you know that God had choose that blesses Mary. How she lived her life. How her parents lived their life. How her ancestors. And God already looked at Joseph. How Joseph lived his life. And his parents, grandparents. Because it is Joseph and Mary, a chosen one, for carrying Jesus, who is also Messiah. There is no such of Mary doesn't have intercourse with Joseph and the book. No, God doesn't go against he creation. The Bible gives you something else. I will explain to you that Mary as the virgin, virgin means she lived her life in holiness. You see that? Virgin is that she lived her life in holiness. Begotten son, son in the Bible, symbolic of the mission, the calling from the Almighty up on individual. That's a son mean. Abraham, he had two sons. One from his wife and another one from his maid. Two sons. Why God still tell him, your begotten son? You see that? See what I'm saying? Son is a nod of blood. To Messiah come in at Jesus, fully man. There's another thing I want to explain to you. The Holy Spirit mean the Almighty God. Spirit is holiness. Not the thought person of the Holy Trinity. The woman in chapter 12 of the book of Revelation, she is a co-creator with the Messiah, create a human soul. The female soul in this world is in her image. As a female, the gender only happened during the creation of the soul. When is the power? There's no gender. You see that? So, the Holy Spirit always existing. It, Holy Spirit is the Almighty Creator. The Almighty Supernatural Power. He has no beginning. He has no end. And he's always existing. That is the Holy Spirit. Not the third person of the Holy Trinity. The third person of the Holy Trinity 
is the messenger of covenant. That while Messiah coming at Jesus already introduced to the world, he said, when I go, I will ask the Father to send you another advocate. In another word, the Messiah come in at Jesus was an advocate. Now he say another one, which is he talking about? The female messenger of covenant, a non advocate. The woman saw with him at his younger sibling, divine sibling. After she was created, she always with him. That's what is that mean of the Holy Spirit. Now, on the book of Revelation, chapter 11, talking about the two witnesses. Who is the two witnesses? The Messiah come in at Jesus, full man, human soul, is the one. And the woman come in, and, and the, oh no, 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 right. The messenger of covenant come in as a female, another witness. This witness is to the existing of the Almighty God. Because these two come in at fully divine and fully human. So they know who's God. Because where they come from. And they're on earth. You know, who is a human, right? You see, that's why that two witness in the book of Revelation chapter 11 mean. This two has all sorts of power. You can go back and read the chapter 12 and 11 of the book of Revelation, you're going to see these two witness power. They can close the sky, prevent rain coming down. Like rain is a symbolic, not the water rain. They can turn water into blood. They're not turning water into blood. It's all symbolic. I will explain in another time, not this time. Because this time I'm explaining about creation of human life on earth. Let me go back to the Genesis chapter 1, 26 and 27. God say, I created men in our image image is the one no 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 s so it's mean that only one the almighty god you can name him any kind of word but there's only one we create men in our image male and female and he continues to say god bless them for them to multiply, fill the earth. Multiply, fill the earth. It means through Mary, you get pregnant and the child born. Okay, that is the purpose of the marriage. Both Father and mother are responsible and liable for, for their children they brought in the world. You have to raise them physically and spiritually. I'm not talking about religion here. I'm talking about do the right thing. Reject the best. You have to raise your child. This 
physically and spiritually. You cannot just give birth to the child so you can get have more kids. And so you can go apply for the welfare and the government gives you money. You cannot do that. That I guess the almighty creator, creation love. Remember, you have to care, love your children. Raise them to a dog. Because of everything, that child, all those children done resolve. You are liable for their damage. Your soul gonna liable for that. I'm saying the same thing. In all the country, in Asian country, a little bit different. But I saw in the United States of America, men and women, they see anybody. I saw their underwear are off. Sex become like fun, like toys. That is not what God creates male and female for. God created male and female for the purpose of carry on his creation. Multiply. You have to make sure you have the capacity to raise the child physically and spiritually. You just cannot have sex. And the child born and just throw them away or have abortion. I tell you, all the women abort their child. One, two, three. You have to deal with the Almighty. Very heavy punishment. Trust me. Trust me. Okay? If you make me sick. There's a lot of organization there. You go to them, hey, help me, so I can give birth to this child. And so I can give to someone to adopt them. Do that way better than have abortion. Abortion, you mother the child. The punishment is very heavy. You don't trust me. When you face the Almighty, you will know. A lot of women have had abortion. They got all sorts of depression, all sorts of ill issues come in their life because they killed that baby. Trust me, I don't lie. I come from God. I know the creation law. And I'm here as a messenger of covenant. I'm governing the human race in this world. The Messiah coming as Jesus already transfer the inheritance of ownership of my daddy, my divine daddy creation product to me. I own it. And I governing it. You don't see me go out and and and, and battle or to kill someone. I don't do that. My power up there do all the work. I saw a lot of people against me. For the last seventeen years I went through. In the fun they very sweet to me. In the back they snap on my back. They all got punished. The reason why I don't want to say it now is a very obviously, very obviously, I just could not believe that when he felt appointment with my team. The devil jumped right in him and he started saying nonsense. Against the reality. 
I'm against the science. That's all I can say for now. In the future, I will say more. Because that thing go through. And I continue to explain to you. So you need to make change. COVID-19. Yes, the science is a right. But again, it depends on the head of the science at the time they do the project with God or with the enemy or in the mix. So, but they then whatever it is they got. Mass hygiene, social distancing is temporary. Prevent constructed COVID-19. The COVID-19 and more deadly virus are right on the way to hit the world. Because this time I'm existing here, my divine father say, this time father had to discipline this human ray. They choose their free will, they go with the destructive devil. They know diff know the know the difference. They don't know the difference between right and wrong. Daughter, go explain to them. That's why you say in the United States of America, the Washington leader leader is everywhere. They've been generating a lot of bad or evil residual power feeding coronavirus COVID-19. Let me go back to the baby after he's born. He will learn from the parent. If he from the good parent, he got a good structure, foundation of the family, he will success. But from time to time, some of the boy inherited bad things so went wrong. And toddler and go to school, learn from friends. Everyone has some sort of spirit, spirit is low and influence other people. So then in school, they learn from friends. If the parent not good, not strict, and enforce the Lord with your children, the children will fail. Now, when they go into teenager, that is the top one here. They like fun. They learn from other. They like sing. Please, their flesh. They don't have a foundation. Understand the soul and the consequence form after everything they done. That's gonna be bad. After graduate from high school, college, now they go in the business world. All sorts of different people. Civilian business. People always do their trick, do their game, so they can earn money. There are some people good, and they do the right thing, and, and they good. And they got a lot of money, they go out and help people. I can say symbolic app, Bill Gates. I'm not campaigning for Bill Gates. Like the last time on other video, I did not campaign for Dr. Anthony Fauci. I just know they're good, and I say it good. But I am not going to say who bad here. Because everything I say, I'm responsible. And I'm liable for the result. But for good people can do example to others. I can say that. So other people can learn from them. But you know what? Those good people also have to go through something, illness, or trouble for them to come close to God, to draw God's power, to draw God's wisdom, 
to solve the problem. You see that? Not the good people smoothly in their life, whole life. No, no, no. Earth is not something like even roses do have to go through all those thorns to get the roses. So the good people in this will still have to go something. So don't make judgment on other people. Please don't. Because the judge judgment on order. 99.9% .9 was wrong. You don't understand what God doing. Right now, I have someone very, very close to my life. I love the God. I do love the God. I need to guide him to understand the almighty creator purpose for him. You will see him with me someday. He come from completely different background than where I come from. He very humble. He say, I will learn from you in spiritual issue. And he does. He does. This man will lead to learn. That's what I learned. We'll lead to learn and understand God and get close to God. Who's my divine Father? Jesus said, when you pray, pray to the Father. He didn't say that you pray to him. I don't understand why people give say, pray to Jesus. Jesus is a phony man. He doesn't have the power to give to anybody. Yes, he phony God as a Messiah. Oh yeah, he has a lot of power. But that power already transferred to the messenger of covenant. He not interfere with the messenger of covenant. And there are some people play, pray to the Blessed Mary. Why? Why they pray to Blessed Mary? Blessed Mary is a, the phony human. She doesn't get to have anything to get. If you say pray, ask her to pray for you, that's a different. But pray to her, it's a totally different. She even prayed to the Almighty. Father, can you do something to the people on this earth so they can stop, pray to me? I don't have anything to give them. Father, you have things to give them. So that's why come to me and I tell you that. Mary, Blessed Mary, her job to give birth to Jesus as a fully man. She is not God. I hear some relation call her mother of God. She's mother of Jesus, the fully man. She is not mother of God. The Messiah is the God. She is not mother of the Messiah. Hear that? I will tell of you right now. Right now, right now. I ban everyone in this world to call my late parent Mother of God. I'm divine. But my parent on the my phony human self. They just too to carry my soul born in the war. They bless us, very bless us. I know both of my parents in heaven. And now uh, I did not at home when both of them passed away. I was worried. And the Almighty Father tell me, I think a few years ago, I already in the calling, I struggling, try to find out who I am, what I am I'm going through. And I asked my divine father for my dad and my mom 
to go to heaven. And the Almighty appeared in my room and said, both of them in heaven. I got that secure. And one time recently, the U.S. Army Brigadier General Dollarwood, I pray for him. I pray for his soul. Because I know he in the military for 38 years. He didn't think in the military against the creation law. Because he had to obey the military. So I pray for him, to his soul, to go to heaven. And the Almighty appeared to me and said, Dana saw already in kingdom of heaven. He is predestined to be your brother. In another word, that he is a member. He become the member of the Holy Trinity. He's a prince, kingdom of heaven prince. But I still feel he's around me. I can feel the the, the, the his his spirit is still heavy. Heavy because of what happened. When he's on earth, he in the war zone, he ate a lot of bad spiritual food. That's why his spirit is still heavy. Even though he's in he, he's already in kingdom of heaven, but his spirit is still heavy. I am gifted. That's how I able to feel the state of each and everyone that the Almighty sent to me. Human soul cannot appear on earthly level. They can be, you can see them in your dream. In your dream is in, in, in higher level, the soul in higher level. But dream always come in as symbolism. Not the same of what you see. You have to pray to understand that. For my late brother, Donna, he has not laid to rest yet. He caskets suck in Toronto, Canada. So he's still around here with me. He's so, I know. In fact, he's here right now. I can feel him. Even because of gifted and as the divine, I can feel things. I can see things in my third eye. But that is now for now. I mean to try to explain to you the true level spiritual realm and ugly realm they work together they are sharing in the same space of the air but on other side invisible side they cannot touch you unless you're gifted so you can feel it. but something they cannot go out and do their own thing they have to get the permission from god but I can say 99.9%, uh, they don't get the perm permission to touch you. Let me explain to you, when your mission on earth to create good deed, good deed means that you do the right thing, help other people, above and beyond your family, yourself. That is the good deed. Do the right thing. Wow, and another part of the world, do the bad thing. Always looking for themselves. Like politicians, they're looking for their position, they're looking for their power, they're looking for their checkbook. Yeah, they say they help you. No, they don't. Part of their job, you put them in there to work for you. But I can tell you only 1% or less than 1% that really there 
to work for you. And while there's a 99% in looking for the benefit, the soul doesn't do the work. The soul in communicate with the Almighty. When you do the good thing, you have direct communication with the Almighty. But when you do evil thing, you still have communication with your Father, the Almighty, the Master. But you have to go through another channel. It's called the devil. So because you choose your free way to do evil thing. So the devil have a control over you. Now, when your soul have that relationship, this way or that way, good or bad, then your soul will generate another power it call spirit, human spirit. The soul is a firm say in your heart, but your spirit lose working in your body and outside your body. Sometimes sibling or husband and wife very close, they can catch each other spirit. To tell that, that is the real, that's the real world. Okay now, when the time of that, your soul leaves your heart out of your body, then no more machine, the soul is the machine generate the power for your body. But when the machine left the body, there's no more machine to generate the power for your body to live. That's how you die. You see that? Life's a beginning of the time of conception. And end at the time that the soul left the body. Now there are some kids, people in coma, they hook the machine to them. It's a depend on how long they are in coma. Sometimes it is short term and they woke up, it's still the same soul. But if they, the, the machine pumped the power for them to breathe, and by the time they woke up, they have a different soul. It's a bad soul that go in that body. Remember that. Not be the same. You will see very different. Very, very different. Different souls are very different. It's still functioning close to the old soul, but not the same. So you on earth you do the good deed, you gain that. When you leave the world, if you have a lot of good deed, you get to go to heaven. But if you did a lot of bad thing, destruction, hurt yourself, hurt your body, hurt your people, you will go down. Stay with the devil. I say thou, but you know, they still share in the same airspace. If I go into the air, it has a lot of evil power, a bad soul. I can feel it. I can feel it. I said, let me get out. I'm not going to be here. I know what kind. Very sensitive. I'm suffer because I'm very sensitive to the supernatural power. It's good because of my work, but it's a very suffer. So you don't pay all the damage while you're alive. When you go, your children pay for it. That become inherited bad thing, born deform, born with illnesses. You see what I'm saying? Don't think that you get away with in this earth. 
then you find no 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 with the almighty just it for all i know what i'm doing i have someone for my rent sue me for something i never done i never done to judge they are blind there's a lot of injustice in the only court. There are a lot of bad lawyers. I don't trust judge because they, they don't have the capacity to judging the correctly. A lot of ugly law wrong. You see that? I don't trust lawyer. I'm sorry, lawyer, but your job, you have to protect people on this earth, but you kill them, their soul, for the lie after earthly lie. So when you got the court reward for you, yes, you might got the money. Yes, you might got the power. Yeah, yeah, you win. But no, 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 don't take that as a win. Deal with yourself correctly. No one in this world can tell you what I tell you. Because I'm right there. When Messiah come in as Jesus, explain to them what the Messiah and Jesus say. I tell you ugly things. You don't believe in me. If I tell you I have anything, then how then? He didn't share with them about the power. He said it for me. Doing it this generation, all things are curved. For me to have all this as evident so I can explain to the world the power, how the power working. Without the power, nothing happened. Animal have a soul. All the living tree have a soul. But the human soul, the highest, the almighty build human soul with the best quality. of his power. Yes, there are certain predestined so. God built them very unique. In another word that this predestined so they cannot deny their calling. They suffer. They went through a lot. Trust me, some of them have to die. That's what my brother Donna U.S. Army Brigadier General. He saw as a predestined. He had to die. He died. I did not know. I just know I missed communication with him. And recently that they notified me. The DA Bank of Afghanistan acting governor notified me. And he make his way over here. He appeared in my room. You know what he said to me? He said, sis, the father called me home. I obeyed the father. See that? Because the Afghan, Afghan government murdered him, but the devil had to get the permission from the Almighty before they can murder my brother. That's why my brother says, sis, Father, call me home. I obey the Father. And he tell me, another person, you replace him. To take on the mission of helping me to carry out my duty. I was Horrible shirt, 
breath and hurt when I find out my brother was dead. And you know what? My brother appeared to that person in his ring and tell that person about me. That person was scared. He told me, Ghana appeared in my ring. He was in military uniform. And here's what he tell me. And I say, oh my God. I say, oh my God. But he's scared. He said the whole day he cannot stand. You see how power come through? Because when my brother come in, talk to that person. So, it's in high level power, not on earthly. So when the conversation in high level power has come with a lot of power, Okay, let me wrap up now. Okay, you understand what I explained about the life after that? You understand that? I will thank you for you listen to what I share with you. Please listen back and forward again and again so you can understand what I say. It's not easy to understand my speak, okay? Because it's obvious that people just don't know it. I know what I'm saying. And I will look forward to share with you a lot more. My father told me, I mean my divine father told me, daughter, you will stay on earth for a while until you finish your work. I don't know how many more years, but from what I see here, the Afghanistan country is the first country on trial. And the Almighty is presiding the case. That's all I can say. So you know, anyone from Afghanistan, you go ask your, your president, what is his name, Ghani? You go ask him. He'll fire up the man over there that my brother appeared to him. He hiding from that person. I want to disclose his name now. He's top ranking officer in the military. I don't want to disclose his name now. Okay, so I'm gonna say goodbye and watch it again, again and again. It's benefit you. It's not benefit me. You believe in me, you don't believe in me. It's not changed me. I said the same because who I am, I'm here to do the work and I go back to the kingdom of heaven. And I say goodbye to all of you. One thing I can ask you, you can turn on TV during my late brother funeral. There will be invoke the almighty eternal creator wisdom and guidance. I believe it's inside the National Cathedral because my brother will be take over there before parade him to Arlington National Cemetery. But there's no room for all of you to come in. You have to watch the news and follow on TV, okay? I believe there's a miracle. I just don't know what my divine father is saying. You see the Fatima, the three shepherd? I believe there's something happened. I, I'm not sure. Maybe something happened very softly or maybe radically. I, I just don't know. Uh, it, <laughs> I only know what my father tell me. But a lot of time he tell me in symbol. Do you see that? 
Okay, so you can, the one that can come in. I'll choose the one to come in there. They will receive invitation directly or indirectly. But most of military is going to be directly through their commander. There is the parade. All right. Thank you and goodbye.